I am Robert Estrin. You're watching livingpianos.com, your online piano resource. I got this viewer comment and question. They said, your enthusiasm is amazing. How do you stay so passionate and enthusiastic? You should make a video on that. No, really. So, you know, at first I read that I was flattered and all, but then I started thinking about it and I thought you might be interested in the backstory as to, you know, why I always seem to be up in all these videos. I mean, I've got over 1200 videos and I don't think I'm really depressed in any of them. Does that mean I'm never depressed? Well, no, everybody has their ups and downs, but here's the key. You know, growing up, I grew up in a musical household. My father, Morton Eston, was a concert pianist. And while he was a professor of music at Hofstra University, he did most of his teaching right at home. It was a big addition in the house, totally separate from the rest of the house, two grand pianos. So I did connect with many of his students. But truth be known, my friends couldn't care less about Bach and Beethoven, Mozart and Chopin. You know, that stuff was kind of like, you know, not cool, right? And so, you know, I, I would play a couple of popular things, but it wasn't really my idiom. I didn't listen incessantly to rock music. There were some that I really enjoyed, but, you know, my, my whole persona, my life was classical music. So after all these years to find people like you who are watching this right now, who are enthusiastic about the piano and classical music the way I am, is actually thrilling. I look forward to these moments. And you know what? It's not easy to find them. I mean, I managed to make videos every week and I've been doing it since 2009. That's a long time, but even right now, I'm here in the showroom, everything looks great, having a good time, but at the same time our water heater went out and the basement's flooded, I'm waiting for a plumber to arrive. So you know, it's not all as rosy as you may think. But the bottom line is this, I take life at face value to a great extent. You live, you die. So you wanna make something happen in between, right? So that's why I make these videos, to be able to share what's important to me. And you know, it really is thrilling to have people like you watch and care about classical music and the piano in the 21st century. It's not irrelevant, is it? I'd love to hear from you. And your experiences with classical music as a child and growing up, do people respect you for it? Or do people kind of mock you for it? I wonder what experiences all of you have had being immersed in classical music, assuming you are. So you can comment on livingpianos.com and YouTube. Thanks so much for the question, and I appreciate the support from all of you subscribers out there. See you next time.